So I'm working on this project here, some sidewalk vaults, and uh, there's been a couple of changes, well, quite a few changes. So instead of just going through papers, I'm going to import a PDF. So go to your export import tab, attach. I'm going to go to the project folder, which is here, documents received. And you can see this is looking for image files right now. Which is just a PDF because I probably put in an image last time. And I believe it's this one here I want. Okay. I usually don't do anything here. I'll do okay. And then I'll just go to the top view. Zoom in. I'm going to first of all click on this. And... I'm going to put it on a PDF layer, which is turned off. So what I'll do is turn that layer on. You'll see that I have another PDF, two PDFs here. So what I'm going to do is maybe what I should do is create a new layer. So let's create a new layer. Go down to the PDF layer and create new. And PDF two and then click on this PDF and add it to the PDF two layer just so we can separate them. And we'll put that in the PDF two layer and then we'll go back and turn the PDF off. Alright, so now we have this one, we're gonna zoom in and we're gonna check what the scaling is. So the scaling on this is a quarter is to one foot. So basically you multiply 4 to get it to an inch by 12 to get it to a foot. So I want to scale this by 48. So right click scale. Pick the start point here and just do 48. And then you can you can give a quick check on your dimensions. Just give it a second. So we'll see where we have we don't really have any dimensions. We have a couple here, so we can just see how close we are. Because you can also scale by reference. So I'm not going to draw over this, but you can see that's 7 foot 8, so it's the same. So it's in the ballpark. So now basically I can see all these, they've added these existing columns. So I want to copy them across. So what I can do now is just draw circles. I'll draw circles where each of these columns are and then I'll copy it from a reference point on this drawing, maybe this corner over here, over to the other project. So that's kind of how I proceed. So I've just shown you how to put a PDF into a document. Alright, hope that helps.